Okay guys, as promised, MCU Collector back with the next video. The video to show off the Vultures flight gear build a figure. Um, so we finally have the last piece that came with the Web Wing Spider-Man. Um, take a quick look at it. A lot of nice sculpted detail in there. Again, minimal paint apps, just to kind of the green that's in there. But um, the, the molded plastic that they use definitely has a little bit of a shimmer and shine to it. Oh, a little bit of paint scuff there. That's... Uh, gonna drive me a little bit crazy, but um, let's just get right to it and let's put this wing set together. Um, so you can see here, I've already put kind of that one propeller um, turbine right on there. Um, and I kind of go right through it and kind of looking at the other one and thinking, okay, how does this thing go? So it's gonna connect there. This one is gonna connect here. So again, you see that little portion there? This is just gonna kind of port right in and snap right into place and then you have the articulation there so you can actually move this all around but we'll get it there so it's kind of pieced and connected together so um, you can see here it's gonna clip right in there together it just snaps into place Again, you have the turbines that, that already on that's already on there. They just kind of snapped right in there as well. Um, all the pieces just kind of snapped together. But you see, you have all the moving parts. So this thing is just fully, fully articulated. Um, just absolutely incredible. Um, so again, it is so large that Vulture will not stand. You know what? He might if you get it. Balance just right. Ah, look at that. You can stand on the zone. You may not even need the stand. But the stand is a nice touch just in case because you get anything that's going to bump right into it whenever you're holding. Actually holds it pretty good. While other figures from the wave fall, this guy is standing up. So not bad. So let's see if we can actually fit the entire wings into the frame of the video to give you guys an idea of how unbelievably large this thing is. Look at that. Wow. Incredible. Um, wow. Uh, <laughs> just, just, just wow. Um, so you can see the, f the figure there all the way spread across, um, filling the entire frame of the video. That is amazing. Look at the sheer size of this thing. That is incredible, but again, a little bit of the articulation. You can get the wings folded all the way in. You can get them down like this. You can get them up like that. Um, bring it back down. But all kinds of articulation in the wings. So very, 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 very cool. Here's a look at the back of it. Again, you could kind of just fold it any which way you want to. So depending on how he may be flying, um, I guess we'll have to wait for the movie to see kind of what some of those looks could be. But you may have something kind of like that where he's flying in. Um, so, uh, just, oh, it's just amazing. I know people are going to hate on the Build-A-Figure. They want a figure. They don't want an accessory piece. Everyone feels that this, that the Vulture should have come with the wings already <clears throat> because it is a part of his character. Well, yes, had it been a deluxe type set... That was $50, $60, or how $40, however much it may cost. This is definitely not a single carded figure because look at the size of this thing. I can't get it. I just, I think this is absolutely awesome. I know lots of people don't like movie figures. I love movie figures. Um, it's kind of the way to go for me. That's what got me into collecting. Um, throw on the fact that it's a Spider Man movie figures in the MCU. Uh, just <laughs> even better. You add all those things together. It's just I you can't I can't pass it up. So you could see with the stand, it just kind of slips right on in there, um, just to help give support to the figure. But as you can see, that figure does not actually need that. Uh, but it's good that it's there just in case to help give it that support in your display. Um, but really cool. I just look at the size of this thing. Absolutely incredible. We look at, you know, Marvel Legends boxes. You put 
you know, two together. We're talking 24 inch wingspan um, for the the uh, Vultures flight gear. Just incredible. Um, so looking at some more details again. Remember this back piece kind of just kind of clips on. You can just pull it right off of the figure. As you can see, in one of the trailers, Michael Keaton's kind of standing back. Um, and the wings kind of come down and then they kind of go on there. So um, this is kind of nice. If you have the wings kind of all the way spread out, you have to make sure you get a good balance um, in the articulation so you don't want to have something kind of folded all the way through. But the wings will actually stand on their own with this stand. So you don't actually even need the figure. Um, but just look at that. That is amazing. I am very, very, very pleased with it. Um, so I, I highly, highly, highly recommend, um, lots of Marvel collectors, you know, we're going to pass on this kind of thing, but I think it is just absolutely incredible. Um, it, it just, it's uh, amazing. I can't be happier. Oh, look at it. So again, here's another look at the figure. Um, you can see the peg there just ports right on into the back of the figure. <clears throat> you have the hole there. So like so <clears throat> and there it is you have vulture so there it is guys have any questions feel free to leave a comment please like the video subscribe if you have not done so but there it is marvel's vulture flight gear from the spider-man homecoming movie um completed <coughs> wing accessory set um that's it guys thanks guys